I I just saw this. Shep Shep posted this, and um, oh my god, this is such gold. Demon Month is off to a good start, I guess. Um, so this, whatever the fuck this is, um, is trying to force everybody in the workplace to bend to their will and say their pronoun crap or whatever the fuck. She then says she gets to a breaking pair. We're just going to play this. I mean... Hi, calling friends. Nobody's picking up, so I just am going to dump this here. It's the middle of the day. I completely understand, but I just had a really harrowing experience at work. I have this one coworker who simply refuses to use the correct pronouns for me. I've called her out every time she misgenders me, and she just is resigned to not change. And today just broke something in me. I just snapped. I ended up yelling at her after the third time she misgendered me and within like 30 minutes like they they i use they them pronouns and she got so defensive and i just started explaining to her like i'm sick and tired of the shit like I you're you're sick and tired of her shit we're sick and tired of this we're not gonna bend our fucking reality to your bullshit you need to at least make an attempt. No, we don't. We don't have to make an attempt. We don't have to do anything. I'm so sick of this. Good, fucking idiot. And she popped off, got upset, got defensive. What are you going to do about it? And I just said, I'm going to be really hurt and sad. Oh, like, no. How that's you... all I can do about it. Oh, the humanity of it, it all. And the worst part is that at that point, my boss, who claims to be so woke and, like, happy and joyous and making a safe, positive environment for everybody. Oh, Jesus Christ. Gangs up on me with her and says, like, this is, Carson, like, shut up. This is not the time for a political statement. <laughs> and I was upset rightfully so but was t trying to take such a level-headed approach to it of like this is not um, imagine having to work with this insufferable cunt or whatever this is I, I don't know what this is i can't tell if this is a a dude or a chick or what i don't know what this is it's up in the air man and and this thing is in there Screaming about you won't bend to my reality and all this. Man, I, I just glad I don't have to work anymore because I, I would be worse than that girl that was like messing with her, man. You know, like she said that she screamed they them and the girl said, What are you gonna do about it? I would I would have said something way worse, man. I just would have been I would have gotten their face and I would have been like I'm not bending my reality to this, and I don't have to do any of this shit. Fuck you and your bullshit. A political statement. My identity is not a political statement. It's just my identity. All no, it's political bullshit. That's why you're doing all this. That's why you're sitting here crying and, oh, look at me. I'm a victim. Oh, the humanity. All I'm asking you to do is respect that. And it really is within our own community <laughs> that people have the most rampant transphobia. I, the yeah, we're tired of this shit. Refuses to use the correct pronouns for me, claims to be bisexual, and she stands up and goes, when I came out as bisexual, everybody was mad at me. It's like, then why are you mad at the trans kid? Like, what? You want to inflict that same pain onto me? Why? It's so frustrating. Because then my boss spins it around as like I'm the one who's making a scene. Yeah, you and are. Being like over emotional or oversensitive, and it's like all I am asking is for you to make an attempt. No, we're not going to make an attempt to do anything. We don't have to do this. I hope these other employees go and file a uh, a discrimination thing. Like, imagine having to work with this. Jesus Christ to try and respect my gender identity and they're both just going at me like this is not the time we're trying our best you should be compassionate and understanding you should just accept it with love and move on like uh, 
it's so frustrating. I literally was shaking so hard. I just got up and left. I came to the beach. I didn't know what else to do. I was so mad. But this is just so hard. <laughs> it's so hard to be out and be vocal about it. It's so hard to stand up for yourself because either you are a doormat or you're the bitch <laughs> that like is over emotional and calls everybody out for the so you start a mess in there. You you she she started a fight with them because she feels finger quotes disrespected because they won't go along with her make believe bullshit. And then she gets the manager and tries to Karen to his ass. And he's just like, hey, you know, we're tired of this political bullshit. You know, I really would like to meet these. Uh, Imagine the imagine the interview that the other people would tell you. I bet if you were to interview the other employees, they'd be like, "Oh, all she does is tell us about her pronouns, and we need to respect her and bow down to her, and all of this." And nobody has to to make an attempt to do anything, nor do we want to make an attempt to do anything. You can take your pronouns and shove them up your fucking ass, whatever the hell this is. Hashtag Demon Month. I'm so sick of these people. Get fucked. All right, let's play the outro.